Yes, some nice music this morning. All right, folks, from passion to profit, this morning's first guest has achieved so much by his own. By learning and using his skills, he created a business out of his heart. Here with us this morning is Roshan Drummond, a.k.a. Bogart. Bog, Bog one. Morning. Morning, Jamaica. <laughs> All is well? All is well. What is, uh, what is typography? What? Uh, typography is actually using letters and words to create art. Oh, where did this yeah. start for you and why did you want to do this? Where did you see this before? Uh, well, it all started when I was going to high school from technical. And uh, in the evening times, I would watch my brother write, watch his friends write in sub. And uh, I kind of liked it. I've always been a fan of the paintbrush. So I just said, oh, let's see how this goes. Is this the only kind of art, painting, drawing that you do? Uh, yes, basically, with a paintbrush. Yeah, so where are you, the ideas come from and, and where you put them? You just decide, so when they are going to write some stuff and what you, what you do with it? Uh, <laughs> Funny enough, it's actually a worldwide thing. Since I started like Instagram, I've linked up with a lot of artists that does the same thing all over the world. And it's, it's more of a culture and it's, there's, it, it's very big globally. Okay. I didn't know that, but uh, if you guys do the whole Instagram thing, you would realize that it's actually a global thing. Oh, do you earn from yeah. this? Or is this just yes, a hobby I, for you? It started as a hobby until I saw where persons were interested in getting quotes, getting their bars written up and stuff like that. Oh, yes. so, so people actually ask you to do stuff? All the time. All the time. So we're looking at some stuff now. So what will you, will you charge them for stuff like what we're looking at now? Uh, it depends on the time, the complication of the work, and all of that. What's the biggest job you've done? Biggest job I've done, well, there's a few. I did one in Montego Bay recently. I always do party promotions before COVID <laughs> and stuff like that. When did you start? I, I, Sorry, go ahead. Finish. When, when did you start the business? I think we lost Roshane, did we? Obviously very talented. Um, have we got Roshane back? Yeah, they call him Bug. Um, I don't know if this is supposed to be Whitehorn or Whithorn. He says he's from Whitehorn. Oh, there's the Honorable Minister. Come with love and it's beautifully done though. Eh? Bright colours and I don't know if deliberately that Hennessy is upside down. I don't know if that is done. <laughs> you hear me? All right. Uh, you hearing us again? Yes, I'm hearing you guys. So I was just seeing a Hennessy bottle with the Hennessy written upside down. It, it was after you had a bottle of Hennessy that you do that part. <laughs> no, it came from an idea. Uh, when I started doing Hennessy paintings, I realized that everyone was doing it with the label the right way, and I think it's probably the wrong way. Hold on, man. Explain that, man. When you say they do it the right way, and you think the right way is the wrong way? Yeah, when you put a bottle of Hennessy in your head, how do, how do you label for setting them? <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. I couldn't figure out why the ambulance sign was there back to front. Um, but then, oh. when you, but when you look in the rear view, you see it the right way, which is why it's back. Exactly. To front. Yeah. I, exactly. I, I understand that. But somebody might take them drunk before them even drink it. <laughs> <laughs> so again, what kind of what kind of costing for for stuff like that pelican sign? What kind of costing for stuff something something like that? Uh, signs range from like $5,000 onwards, as I said, depending on the complexity of the job. Okay. And uh, 
yeah, stuff like that. You see, you got a bar menu sign that was actually for a wedding for some tourists that came down in the grill. Oh, beautiful. So now this is a full-time business for you? Ah, uh, yes. Actually, a full-time business. Okay. But you don't have a physical space. You were saying you have to go on Instagram and stuff to find you, right? Uh, that's for persons... That's for persons that are actually uh, miles away. I wouldn't say come to my office. I would just say hit me up on Instagram and I get you what you want, where you want it. Yeah. Congrats, Roshan. Um, I love it. It's, it's beautifully done. Um, Thanks. Boy, you're so, you're, you're so talented. Congrats, my friend. And, and stay safe, all right? Yes, and I would actually ask persons to visit my Instagram just to see what typography is all about and yeah. what I do is all about. Because it's, it's not just boring words and boring bottles. It's actually an, a, a passion of mine. It, it's actually yeah. a passion of mine. So you got the dancehall posters going there. It's, it's actually a passion of mine. So I would like encourage persons to visit and uh, you know see what it's all about yeah man great great to see you great to talk to you and stay safe good luck my friend god bless you all right thank you never yeah man roshan bogart drummond they call him bogart <laughs> visual artist up next unlocking your creativity soon come stay with us please <laughs>